Hey guys, so I have two cups of mozzarella cheese, a fourth cup of um, butter, which is I believe about four tablespoons. And I'm gonna melt this all together. This is gonna be part of the recipes for the keto, um, what is it, gnocchi. So here's the starting of the dough. Okay hey guys, so this is the next part. I have two cups of fine almond flour one egg already mixed in i need to stir it up a little bit more and then i'm going to add the two cups of cheese and the fourth cup of butter by the way i also added one egg yolk so one egg and one egg yolk stirred it around a little bit but this is pretty much how you want it to look when um before putting it into your um mixture your dry ingredients so yeah this is it i better work fast because this does get cold and it is a little hard to work with once it starts to get cold so um i will be right back okay so this is how it should look when it's done i mean there's some parts that didn't like hold on you can still kind of see the cheese but i'm gonna still work with it i'm gonna like kind of um roll it out now and try to cut it up and i will show you guys that guys I have my little helper over here he's putting the little fork marks in and now this will just go into the refrigerator for about like 10 to 15 minutes and then we will cook these up right Presley right. guys I'm gonna put two tablespoons of this extra virgin olive oil so I'm just gonna eye it I think that's about that should be about two tablespoons maybe a little over just kind of, yeah, maybe a lot. I think that might be a little bit too much. I'm going to take some out. All right, guys, I'm cooking it on medium heat. Um, I put about seven to eight ounces of mushrooms, a clove of garlic, and I'm just going to saute that and then add the chicken. Okay, so I just added the chicken, salt, and a little bit of garlic, uh, sorry, onion powder. And I'm going to add on top some... Um, peppers or yeah some black pepper and then this is about three pieces of chicken breast okay, so I'm gonna let the chicken cook for a little bit um, I got two cups of heavy cream that I'm gonna add to it and then I'm going to add the um, what are these again the nookie right nuki. <laughs> so I'm gonna add that to it and then I will show you guys when it is done 
All right, guys, so I added the two cups of heavy whipping cream, um, some butter, a little bit more mushrooms, and I added the gnocchi. Um, some of them that were more, a little bit small, and I, the best thing is to freeze them a little bit too. I didn't freeze them that long. I kind of just put them in the fridge. Um, so some of them did melt, but I mean, it's still so good. There's some still in pieces, but now it just makes it more cheesy. Um, because I did do kind of like a fat head dough. And yeah, that looks good. And what I'm gonna do is, here's my chicken. I did take it out. I'm just gonna throw some chicken on top and I'm gonna serve this up and eat it like that. The finished result. It is a little um, thick and cheesy, so if you want it more liquidy, just add more um, heavy cream or water to it. But I love it like this. It's kind of like a macaroni. It is a mushroom um, nookie, but I decided to add in just a little bit more protein just to have some chicken, something a little bit more solid. Um, and I did add in all of the little nookies. Um, that it called for but I mean I'm thinking if you don't want it as thick so it doesn't melt as quick I would say do half of the recipe because um, since it is you know fat head dough so it is cheesy you already have cheese in it um, it did kind of make it a little bit more um, thick I guess so um, try that um, I might try another one later down the road and do half and see how it comes out but it tastes amazing so i'm gonna enjoy this and i will um, see you guys in my next video thanks for watching